for, for today's episode of Potion Trading. I had a good idea to give it the Potion Trading uh, a completely new idea with it. That way um, we can have more episodes to the series. And the idea was since we since we mix soda, sodas on this uh, series and maybe some people aren't a fan of sodas, well then you can still be a potion creator yourself. If you don't want to use sodas, you can use this. cereals. We're going to try mixing some cereals to try to get a new flavor of cereal. Cool idea. You're probably thinking, well, it sounds like a pretty plain idea. Okay, then I one up it. We're going to use a uh, different kind of milk with our cereal. That way, it is actually a potion, or like we like to say. Welcome to another episode of Potion Creator. So today we're going to be using some, these are two cereals I picked up at CVS. I don't know if they'll be good or not, they're probably old, honestly, I won't lie to you. They have a date. Oh yeah, best if used by, here we go. Okay, 2023, so next year. Or, oh, check out this one. Best if used by 11, December 11th, 2022. I picked this up yesterday. It's the, it's the 20th of December. So these are kind of 10 days old. That's a bummer, but hopefully they ain't too bad. I don't see how they can be bad. They're Cocoa Puffs. Maybe they'll make us more cocoa. Who knows? There we go. Okay. Uh, Lucky Crisp. They look like they have a nice sugar coating to it. I gotta try one of these. Every time I see a, a cookie cereal, I love it. Because look, it's just like a... What the heck? That was something in the cabinet. Do I dare open it? No, some probably jump out at me. What's in the box? No. Hmm. Yeah, something's in that cabinet. The camera died, but uh when I added the eggnog, by the way, this is the eggnog I use. Any eggnog would do, as long as it's good eggnog. But this eggnog I used here, some Golden Kemp's eggnog. I actually ended up throwing out the Cocoa Puffs because the Cocoa Puffs, they actually smelled really bad, so I just threw them out. And so what I did was, is once I made the bowl of cereal using the the cookie crisp and then the egg dog. I, I chilled it in the fridge for five minutes and then I put it up in the freezer for ten minutes. And that's what we got here. Why? Because I wanted to make some frosted cookie flakes basically. Oh by the way I kept it wrapped up with three paper towels because that way it could go over and under it. That way because Sometimes I think bugs could actually get in the fridge, so that's why you always want your food to be in a nice container Or at least have a paper towel over it, even if you're leaving in there for five to ten minutes like I did. But anyways, here's our cookies Frosted Frosted uh, Cookie frosted flakes Using cookie crisp and make done. Looks pretty good. Some people are probably thinking well, this is pretty lame still. It's just cereal all right i got you we got meet my new friend Subi the honey bear then let's see what Subi the honey bear has to say about that i probably shouldn't have left it in the fridge because i don't think they're supposed to i don't know if you leave honey in the fridge or not oof i mean if i have to use it with two hands there's no way i could get this out with one one hand in the fridge but anyways, we got us a dab of honey there. That should make it more of like a potion. Alright, now it's time for the taste test. Let's give this a try. It's crazy, the eggnog turned into like a cream. 
In fact, I'm thinking I should have added a little bit more, but I'm thinking because since eggnog is so thick, it's not like you really want to eat too much of it. So, I think that's just the right amount. Anyways, let's give this a try. There's a lot of honey on that bite. I'll try this again. That's really good. Honestly, this is like a almost 10 out of 10. The cookie, the crisp cookies actually is a little bit on the bland side. The mixture is good though. That there is a 9 out of 10. Frosted cookie, what's it called? Cookie frosted flakes. Yeah. What do you, what do you think in the comments below? Let me know. Sorry. It's such a creamy meal, it makes it hard to talk. But, um, let me know in the comments below what you think about doing uh, at, like mixing some cereals together or some cereal with different kind of milk and trying that out for a review for uh, our potion creating series here. As you can see this was a pretty good idea. So this was Cookies Crisp, a little caramel, uh, caramel syrup and Oh no wait, not caramel syrup, my bad. I got confused. That's what I was going to add, but instead I added the honey. A little honey. And egg nut. The more I eat it, the more I lean toward 8 out of 10, honestly. So yeah, I hope you all enjoy it. Peace out. Stay awesome.